formation consisting of Army Reserve soldiers that are coming together from over 32 different states, all brought together one month before deployment, and that is thanks to the company leadership of Captain Shelby Peters and First Sergeant Trenton Byler. Mr. President, also here in the room, we have our highly dedicated soldiers, like Sergeant uh, Jonathan Ochoa and Specialist Robert Wallace. And finally, Mr. President, uh, we have Specialist Brett Nyquist, who has been dying for at least a week to ask you a question, if that's okay with you. Go ahead, whatever you want. <laughs> This Christmas, I hope every member of our military will feel the overwhelming love and gratitude of our nation for your faithful service. Starting January 1st, you'll be getting your largest pay raise in more than a decade. You don't have to take it. If you want, you can turn it back into the government. But we got you a good pay raise last year. We're going to get you an even better pay raise this year. It'll be the largest in over a decade, and you very much earned it. And don't worry, I'm only kidding when I say turn it back, because uh, the press will cover that. They'll say, he wants them to turn the pay raise back. No, I got it for you. Keep it. We'll find out what the surprise is, and we'll deal with it very successfully. And let's see what happens. Uh, everybody's got surprises for me, but let's see what happens. I handle them as they come along. Maybe it's a nice present. Maybe it's a present where he sends me a beautiful vase as opposed to a missile test, right? I may get a deposit. I may get a nice present from him. You don't know. You never know. I think I'll, I'll answer that by saying I'm still working on the Christmas present. Is that okay? <laughs> <laughs> there's a little time left. Not too much, but there's a little time left.